Okay, good morning. Uh, this is the review of topics we discussed in part two of multiplication and division uh, in our basic operations section, prime factorization. So what we're looking at here is the problem we solved where we have 27 and we're looking to find the prime factorization of 27. We break it down using a tree. Three times nine is 27. Three is a prime number. So that's a, an end. We don't have to go any further there. Nine can be broken further down. Three times three is nine. That means that three times three times three is 27. And so the prime factorization of 27, we're gonna write as a base number, three. The only factor in 27 is three. And then the exponent, three, which is three because we have one, two, and three of these factors. So three cubed or three to the third power is the prime factorization of 27. Uh, looking at our other example, the number 54, six times nine is 54. Both of these numbers can be further broken down. Six is three times two, nine is three times three. So my prime factorization of 54 is gonna be the factors two times three times three times three. There's three of them, so it's three cubed. So this here, that's the prime factorization and the dot, that's that way of writing multiply. Two times, oops, doesn't look great, times three to the third power is 54. Okay, so assignment, I would like you to write the prime factorization of as many numbers as you can, starting with 60 and going up to 80. That's 20 numbers, so it's a lot. Do as many as you can. All right, we'll, we'll cover some of them in class tomorrow night.